Okay, here I am on my computer um, in French class, and there's an assignment that requires um, you to use one of these Google Drive assignments. So basically, you go here, and uh, you can work on your document. Now, this isn't as intuitive when doing this from your iPad. And so I'm gonna show you a couple of different ways that you can do it through the app or through a browser on your iPad. Okay, so here I am on my iPad. I am scrolling down, finding the same assignment, and I'm using the Schoology app. Uh, now, for some, this might work. So this is the same assignment we just looked at, and you'll notice that when I click on it and click on my document, it's not quite working. So it, it says you need to connect to Google Drive. So I'm gonna try that first. I'm gonna say connect and it will ask me to log in. And it might ask me to allow Schoology to talk to Google Drive. So I'm gonna say that. Let's see what happens here. It may work. So unlike on my computer, instead of seeing the document here, I just see this icon. So what I need to do is just tap it or click it and open an app. Okay, so launch Google app. Let's see if it works. Now, if you aren't already signed into your Google uh, Elmwood account, you have to do it at this point. Just say add another account or sign in if the box uh, shows you. Type in your username at elmwood.ca and password, and then it'll open up that document for you. And you can see, I believe it's opening, opening up the template. Now there's nothing in the template, but I believe that is how it should appear. So I can add something here. I'll throw in a text box. Hello. Okay, I'm gonna say I'm done working on it. So I'll go back to Schoology and I'm gonna say submit assignment. Actually, not yet. Now, if this didn't work, you could always use a browser and go to elmwood.schoology.com and then log in with your account. And here is the assignment. Let's have a look to see what it looks like here. When I click on my document here, what happens? The same thing. I can click down here and it should jump me over to the app where I can see the assignment that I began. Let's edit it one more time, add something else to it. Uh, let's add a shape. Let's add a rounded rectangle. There we go. So that we've made two changes there. And let's go back to Chrome. And now let's go check on the computer to see if we see the same progress over there. Okay, we're back on our computer again, logged in as our test student, and we're gonna go uh, click on my documents to see if it shows us the progress. And indeed, there it is, we can see the word hello, we can see a rounded rectangle the, like we added on the iPad, it's all here. I can go ahead and click edit if I wanna work on it. And if I'm done, I can say submit assignment. And that is how you can work on the document on your iPad.